Regarding Marc Marquez's performance at Ducati the next year, Valentino Rossi has made his initial forecast. With Grassini replacing Repsol Honda for the 2024 MotoGP season, Marquez should have the equipment necessary to contend for the title once more. With six Premier Class victories, Marquez is just one title short of his enduring adversary Rossi's record. Welcome to Bike GP. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon for more updates, Rossi said. Mark's arrival will be very interesting to see, prior to the Valencia test, in the same way that Ducati will handle it. Our team needs to be in good shape because Mark is going to be very dangerous. At last week's Valencia MotoGP, Marquez's farewell race for Honda was marred by an altercation with Marco Bezzecchi, the VR46 rider, who is Rossi's apprentice. After getting in touch with Marquez, Bezzecchi's race came to an end, which led the young Italian to go looking for answers from the seasoned Spaniard in his motorhome. Bezzecchi called Marquez the dirtiest rider in MotoGP, but they'll be riding together on a Ducati next season. Bezzecchi chose to remain with Rossi's VR46 over moving to Pramac, where he would have benefited from a factory spec Desmosedici. Bezzecchi's breakout season as a title contender prompted talk of the relocation. Rossi clarified, We thought that Ducati would offer us the factory bike, an aspiration that was eventually dashed. Indeed, we used our teeth to protect Bezzecchi. But we're hoping there won't be much of a difference between the GP24 and the GP23, as we aim to challenge Bezzecchi for the championship. According to Fabio Di Gianantonio, he will be able to learn from seven-time MotoGP champion Valentino Rossi by joining Muni VR46. After the Valencian Grand Prix on Sunday, Fabio Di Gianantonio, who nearly won a second MotoGP race in a row, confirmed his transfer to Muni VR46. When it became apparent that Moto2 sensation Fairman Aldegar would remain in the intermediate class, the Italian, who has been among the most consistent riders of late, was able to secure his future. Marc Marquez won Fabio Di Gianantonio's Grassini seat. Speaking for himself though, Fabio Di Gianantonio is eager to begin work with the Rossi-led team. This year has been an amazing journey and a roller coaster of emotions, Fabio Di Gianantonio said. We have an agreement with one of the best teams in the grid, and they are really formidable, the spokesperson said. They have performed a fantastic job this year, so I believe I will have a great opportunity to learn from both of them and Valentino, without a doubt. I can't wait to start working together, and I'm really proud that we were able to finalize this together. Just a few days ago, Fabio Di Gianantonio appeared certain to secure a spot in the 2024 MotoGP after his victory in Qatar. However, when Luca Marini decided to join Repsol Honda, the Italian was legitimately transferred to Muni VR46 forcing them to find a replacement. Fabio continued, When we started this season, we had a plan regarding my growth, in reference to his erratic campaign. We were coming off a difficult year the previous year, so we couldn't have predicted that we would be battling for podiums in the opening races. The objective was to gain some knowledge and get better. You have to learn, therefore it takes time. We intended to follow the schedule and give our whole attention to the tasks at hand. Over the course of the year, both the speed and the bike sensation increased. Both the confidence and the results were increasing. What are your thoughts? Let us know in the comment down below and don't forget to like and subscribe for new upcoming videos of MotoGP. Thanks for watching.